What's up, everybody? Cloud9, man. We're going to have the second episode of Cowboys Chat Box. Thank you for tuning in. I got a reporter out there going to bring us some of the latest news about the Cowboys. First of all, Deron Bland is injured. He's on the injured reserve list. He uh, may be out up to eight weeks recovering so it could be several games before he comes back we got updates on that and who's going to take his place now the guy that's taking his place i'm not i've never heard of him but we're going to find out who he is they also sign are hoping to sign another player to be on the other side so we got some changes on the defense Hopefully it don't hurt us none, but you never know. Right now, we're going to let Baylor Parks tell us about the, the guy that's taking the place of Deron Bland for the first part of the season. Kellen Carson, affectionately known as Seat Bell Carson, will be thrust into the limelight when the rookie takes over the starting role over the next several weeks to begin the 2024 season. Due to a foot injury suffered by NFL pick six King Daron Bland, the rookie fifth round pick has had an exceptional training camp and head coach Mike McCarthy believes he's ready for all that awaits him, effective September 8th against the Browns in Cleveland. The Cowboys are adding more depth to the cornerback position with the expected signing of veteran Amani Orwari. A fifth round pick of the Lions in 2019, Orwari has started 36 games with nine career interceptions, including six in the 2021 season. He spent last year in Jacksonville but played just one game due to injury. The Cowboys recently put Daron Bland on IR for at least four games with a stress fracture in his foot. Trevin Diggs is coming off ACL injury last year. The Cowboys have Jordan Lewis, Kellen Carson, Andrew Booth, and Israel Mukuamu at the position on the 53-man roster. We're also going to talk about C.D. Lamb's contract and Dak Prescott, if he's going to get a contract or not. So we're going to talk about that. We're going to let uh, Baylor Parks explain what's going on with C.D. Lamb and Dak Prescott's contract. The receiver has agreed to a four-year, $136 million extension with Dallas, NFL Network insiders Eon Rapoport and Tom Pellicero reported on Monday. Lamb will also receive $100 million guaranteed and a wide receiver cord $38 million signing bonus per Rapoport and Pellicero. Dallas Cowboys quarterback Dak Prescott enters the upcoming 2024 season on the final year of his four-year, $160 million contract while carrying a cap hit of $55.5 million, the second highest in the entire NFL in 2024 behind only Cleveland Browns quarterback Deshaun Watson's $63.8 million cap charge. Dak said in an interview, not really sure if he will be the next to sign a big deal with Dallas. Not my focus anymore, to be honest. I can't say it was ever my focus. It's about getting this team better. On one hand, it's way too early to think about where Cowboys quarterback Dak Prescott might play in 2025. On the other hand, it's right on time. If Prescott becomes an unrestricted and unfettered free agent, he'll arguably be the biggest free agent since the original free agent, Hall of Fame defensive end Reggie White. Cowboys owner Jerry Jones said he does not expect to sign Dak Prescott to an extension before the opener, but that does not preclude the team from continuing to negotiate into the season. In the end, though, it's the quarterback's decision. So there you go. Dak may not get a contract this year, but C.D. Lamb did get one, and he's going to be on the field. Dak's going to be on the field. This is his last year of his contract. 
hopefully he'll get another deal if not we have to move on and let him go where he needs to be there is several teams that's looking or would be looking if he was available as a free agent including the giants that means he would be on our rivalry team and we wouldn't like that very much but anyways cowboys in cleveland september 8th don't forget i'll be here play by play so hope you guys join in until then i'll see you in the next one <laughs>